guys so i'm preparing to get in the shower um, i decided to do something different and do a little voiceover so as you can see i'm getting ready for the shower i got my shower cap on these are the products that i'm going to be using which is the coffee and then the bluff city body oil so i'm going to take the coffee coconut which this smells really good um, it lavishes up really well um, so i'm just going to take some time and just use that all over my body and make sure that it really gets into my skin and then i'm going to take that same body wash and i'm going to get it worked into my legs and onto my feet in between my toes and i really love this body wash because it's something that sticks to you and you can smell it all day and it really makes my skin feel so so good and i just really love the smell of it and i'm just going to keep working it in i'm all done with the shower so i'm going to go ahead and get my teeth brushed really nothing special that i use um, other than my mouthwash which you guys will see that once i get there but i'm just going to go ahead and get my teeth brushed So now I am using my TheraBreath mouthwash, which I'm pretty sure you guys have seen this on YouTube before. It has the xylitol in it, which is more of like a sweet mint taste. Um, as you know that this brand has like a pink bottle, blue bottle, orange bottle. Um, I wanted to try the blue bottle because it said that it had more of a stronger mint. And then just the xylitol um, takes more of an effect on bacteria. So I really do like it um, thus far. So make sure that you go and check this out. So now I'm going to start my skincare in which this is a facial wash that I use. It is the Acura Brightening Cleansing Gel. And I know that it's not too focused, but the ingredients are pomegranate, blackberry, and alki. It's 100% vegan, Caribbean free, sulfate free. And I really love this facial wash. Um, I bought it from Target probably about a year ago and I'm just now using it. But since I have been using it, I can definitely tell the difference in my skin as far as the brightening of my skin. Um, you don't need a lot. It definitely has like a lemon smell to it but I really love it and it makes my skin feel so cool and so soft now I went ahead and washed that off off camera so now I'm gonna take some paper towel because you all know that paper towel is the best way to dry your face just pat dry my skin so this next product is called Pixel. This is a vitamin C brightening toner. We all know that we need that good vitamin C. So this is a product that I always use right after I use my facial wash. I picked this product up from Ulta about a week or so ago. It costs about $18, um, but I really love this product. It smells really good. Um, it really works as a anti oxidant um, probiotic and it has willow bark and fruit extract in it and as you can see um, I just put a little bit on a cotton swab and I just put it on my skin and I love the smell of it and I can definitely see the results in my skin since using this product So I wanted to give you all like a close-up of my skin. I know you really can't see it when I'm afar off, but as you can see, I'm still applying the product. And y'all, I'm telling y'all, I know I haven't really showed my skin much, but my skin has improved 100% since I've been using the products that I'm going to be showing you and that I have showed you. And I'm really pleased. So if you are interested in just getting your skin more clear and working on your hyperpigmentation, these products I definitely recommend and I will list them in the description box. Now this next product, I'm not gonna be using in the video, but this is Admire My Skin. This is a brightening serum, and this is specifically for hyperpigmentation. So if you have some dark spots on your face, you wanna spot treat it, I have been using this, and also I have seen great results with this as well. So this next item, as you can see, is the Black Girl Sunscreen. Listen, every woman, whether if you're a woman of color, every woman needs this sunscreen in their facial regimen. I purchased this at Ulta. It cost $16. And y'all, when I tell y'all that this sunscreen is a holy grail product, that is exactly what I mean. So when I use this product, I just kind of do like a little spot treatment with it i don't put like too much because it is very heavy but light at the same time it leaves no white residue um it has jabobo and avocado in it and y'all i can't tell you how much i love this and it's also like a moisturizer um so even if i didn't want to use a moisturizer after this like my skin would look so moisturized and hydrated but you guys i really really love this product the black girl sunscreen And 
last but not least, I'm just going to use my regular Cetaphil moisturizing cream. This is a very good cream that I always get from the Dollar General. It costs about only $4. Um, it's very hydrating. I'm not going to use much of it because as I was explaining about the Black Girl Sunscreen, that is actually a moisturizer within itself. So I'm just going to use a little bit of this product. So now I am all dressed. So this is my little outfit of the day. And yes, I am rocking my Whitney Houston shirt. Got my little stud earrings in and my God is dope hat. So here is a full view of what I'm wearing. I have my red chucks and jeans, Whitney Houston shirt. I have my Michael Kors crossover body bag and then just a hat, just something simple and comfortable. So as you guys can see, I'm now at the nail salon. I'm gonna be getting a full set today with the French manicure and a design. I really didn't get to vlog much of this process, guys, because my nail tech was in a rush, but she did a great job, but I really didn't get to record this part um, as I wanted to. And here are the final results of my nails and you guys i love my nails so much she did a really great job and i really love the set and so now i'm arriving at another salon called pampered nails and spa i come to this salon you guys to get my feet done yes i do go to two locations i really love how they do their pedicures they make it so relaxing and they do a really great job so guys this is my favorite part whenever i get my pedicure done I really love the way that this, I guess you can call it like a scrubber pad. I love the way that this feels on my feet. It just makes my feet feel so massaged and so clean. And I just love the texture of the pad that she's using. So this is my favorite part. Now this is another favorite thing of mine during the pedicure. As you see, she is using some black hot stones and she's rubbing them across my legs and across my feet. And you guys, I'm telling you, this feels so good. That's why I really love this salon. I've never had this done before, but it was really, really nice. So since I do have the French manicure set on my nails, I did decide to go with the white gel color on my toes. I usually don't go for white, but I wanted everything to match. so. They really turned out really great. So guys, it's around lunchtime and I'm out at Chipotle and I'm grabbing my son some lunch. He really loves their steak tacos. So before heading home, I'm just making a quick stop to grab him some lunch. So I decided to stop at Burger King for lunch. I had Burger King earlier this week and it was really good, so I'm going back. I know it's not the healthiest, but hey, why not? So last but not least, I did decide to stop at Starbucks. So if you watched my last video, then you know that I tried their strawberry refresher for the first time and it was really good. So this time I'm going back to try something different. I'm getting another refresher, but this time I decided to add mango pieces in it and it was really good. So I wanted to stop and get this before going home. Uh -huh.